that around 1 million people die every year in India because of malaria. Before its cause was even discovered, people thought malaria was caused because of bad air. That's what the term malaria even means in Italian. So, how did we come to the discovery of malaria? Well, all thanks goes to Dr. Ronald Ross, who was a military doctor and performed experiments on malaria for 16 years until he discovered that it was the female Anopheles mosquito that carried the microbe for malaria and fed on infected patients. He was awarded a Nobel Prize in 1902 for his discovery. Most of his time he worked in India and during his research he met Dr. Patrick Manson. Dr. Manson was the first one to propose that maybe mosquitoes carried malaria just how they carried filaria. To test this theory, Dr. Ronald Ross made mosquitoes bite malaria patients and then bite healthy men. But nothing happened. He tried this again and again and still nothing was happening. Unfortunately, he was using Culex mosquito species that actually do not carry malaria. One day, he noticed a different type of mosquito species on his window and he called it the dapple wing mosquito. He recalled that filaria is carried by only one species of mosquito. So what if it was the same for malaria? So he started experimenting with the larvae of these dapple wing mosquitoes. On 19th August 1897, he killed one of these dapple wing mosquitoes that had fed on a malaria patient. He observed some peculiar cells growing inside the stomach of these mosquitoes. On 20th August, he realized that these cells were now having some certain outlines. And then he realized that each and every cell had these cells which were black and pigmented. At last, Dr. Ronald Ross discovered the path of malaria, how it travels from an infected patient's blood to the stomach of the mosquito, to the salivary gland, and then to a healthy person. That's why 20th August is now celebrated as World Malaria Day. So, what have we learned today? Today we've learned about the story of discovery of malaria. Until next time, happy learning!